Welcome my friends of the interwebs. Um, listen, this is gonna be a very important video and if you could please uh, stick around uh, for a little bit. It's gonna be about Cambria, about Cambria Lee. Um, that's what this video is gonna be about, but please indulge me real quick. I got a, a Christmas card today from the Altopian. I've not had a card from him in a long time. I actually have not gotten anything from anybody in a long time. <laughs> Everybody sends the girls all kinds of stuff and then, you know, screw the colonel. But it, it is what it is. I, I'm okay with that. Uh, but I did want to open this. I started to open this in the house. I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> and so I'm going to go ahead and open this on camera. Okay. It says the Utopians, Dale and Vicky. Uh, Richard, we hope you have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, Dale and Vicky. Thank you very much. That is a wonderful card, and it is very much appreciated. Um, I didn't send any cards out this year, although <laughs> I did pay for some to get sent out. Uh, some of you have seen uh, Jeff from Cutlery Lover and Superfly Fat Guy and Rants with Jeff. That is the card that I sent out featuring Cambria Lee. Um, basically you know wishing you all a uh, merry christmas if you didn't get on her uh christmas card list shame on you you were very naughty um <laughs> by the way this is a classy photo i took it i'm very proud of it yes uh it's a little bit on the sexy side um but you know she's a 25 year old woman and she likes to get pretty now and again that's just the way it is um some people uh, uh get it some people don't it is what it is. All right, so let me get to her since it's almost two minutes into this video. Um, okay, here's the drill. Uh, Cambria Lee, Cambria. And by the way, she doesn't know I'm making this video. I hope it doesn't piss her off because I'm going to say some things in this video that need to be said. And um, I probably should have talked to her about it first, but you know, you know how I am, guys. I just I get a wild hair up my ass and away I go. Okay, Cambria Lee is training to uh, be a competitive shooter. Uh, some of you uh, know, and by the way, if you don't know who Cambria Lee is, uh, I'll have a link to her channel down below. Uh, but she's training to be a competitive shooter, and guys, she's damn good. She just is damn good. Um, it's a natural thing for her, and now she's taking that natural ability and really working on it. And it's not been easy for her because, let me tell you something, we have been practicing, practicing, practicing at the farm in the very, very bitter cold. And we'll run a stage and then run back into the car and let her get warmed up. But, you know, she is as tough as nails. She really wants this. Her dream is to become a serious competitive shooter. Um, and then someday she wants to be a firearms instructor. And I think that's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Um, she's the first uh, female that I've personally worked with that I looked at from, oh, really from the very beginning. And if you guys have followed her channel or, or, or anything, I'll, you know, from the very beginning, I was like, oh my God. Um, yeah, she's the first female that I've worked with that I that I looked at and thought to myself, this this girl can can do it. She can, she can compete. She can go places. Um, so anyway, why is this an important video? Well, here's the thing. Um, we borrowed Polish Steve. Uh, that's not his YouTube name. I just nicknamed him Polish Steve. Some of you have been around for a while know who I'm talking about. Uh, really super, super great guy. Uh, I can't say enough about him. I mean, he really... I met him through YouTube. Now I'm not going to get into that whole story. Maybe someday I'll tell it. But... Um, just a great guy. Doesn't live all that far from me. Maybe, you know, 25 minutes. Um, just... But anyway. He loaned her his gun, uh, Glock 17, for her first pistol match. Well, some of you don't know, some maybe you don't know. It's on her channel. Her employer, which is a pizza joint, pizza chain, um, backed order. I mean, she asked for it off like three weeks in advance, and then a week before the match, they told her they, they had a mandatory meeting for her to go to, and it was mandatory. And it was really the look of... I can't even describe the hurt you could see in that girl's eyes because she had put so much time and effort into practicing, um, getting ready for that. And it just, you know, I mean, but real life kind of gets in the way. You know, it just does. And she's uh, kind of like a junior management person. I mean, like a team leader type person. And I think she's hoping, uh, at least in the short term in her life, to, to become more of a, a bigger manager. 
it means more money to her because she, listen guys, she doesn't, I mean, she works her ass off, but she doesn't have a whole lot of money. She's a single mother. She has a 25 year old single mother working in a pizza joint. Okay, that pretty much should spell it out for you. I mean, really. And she's a very, she's got a lot of pride. She goes to work every day and I, that's the part that I really hope she doesn't get upset with me about. I don't mean to say that stuff to put her down because she's a very hard worker. She is a damn good person and she does everything she can to make money for her and her daughter. So, having said that, here's the problem or here's the conundrum. Um, YouTube, you know, James Yeager just made a video about this recently. You can go check it out. You know, James Yeager has over 200,000 subscribers. And it's got to the point with YouTube where they, ever since the, the merger between Google Plus and YouTube, it really has sucked the money out of YouTube. Um, it used to be as a YouTuber, you could make some fairly decent money, you know, uh, anymore. It's you, you gotta, you gotta fight for every dime you make. And you know, most of the time, I mean, Cambria doesn't make a ton of money on YouTube. She just doesn't. Neither do I. It's <laughs> just so you know, Cambria and I, I, I have a very good business relationship, uh, but neither one of us are making a whole lot of money. Um, so and no, nobody is. I and mean, James Yeager's not with 200,000 subscribers. Cutlery Lover will tell you the same thing. It's just not what it was. Um, here's the thing. So we can't just perpetually or continue to borrow Steve's gun. Um, it's not fair to him. Um, I mean, you know, hell, he's never even met Cambria, <laughs> you know, um, you know, it's one of those things. So anyway, I talked to him. Cambria did say she'd be interested in maybe trying to buy it if there was some way he could let her make payments. And I said, well, you know, let me talk to him. Well, Steve's like, look, I got this other guy I'd like to buy. I'll sell that to her. And I'll give her a really sweet deal, which he is. Uh, it's it's uh, a, almost new. I mean, I was one of the first people to shoot this gun, so I mean, I've been familiar with it from the start. It's a Gen 4 Glock 17, and he wants 475 for it with five magazines, and which is awesome. It's a good deal for a gun that's fairly new. Um, she can't afford that, guys. She, there's just no way she can afford 475 bucks, and Steve really can't let her make payments. I mean, it's just he's not like. I mean, it, it's. I mean, he would if he could, I'm sure. But I mean, you know, well, I mean, it's just one of those things. He's giving her a great deal anyway. So what I'm going to try to do is raise $475 for our girl Cambria. Um, now, before any of you say, well, Colonel, why don't you just buy her gun? Hey, listen, <laughs> that's all I can do these days to keep up with paying for the ammo. Uh, but I will do this. I promise you this. If we can raise the 475 for the gun, I will buy the other five magazines that she will need to compete. It takes 10 magazines to compete with less grief. That way there's no reloading of mags in between uh, target A and target B. Um, it will just make her life a little bit easier to have 10 mags. I will pay for that. So at the low end, you're looking at um, 125 bucks for me, plus shipping, whatever, a tax. Or maybe there won't be tax, but you know what I'm saying. At least 125 bucks. So I'm kicking that in. But let's see if we can't put the other together. Now, here's the thing. Before a lot of you start screaming, oh, e-bagger, oh my God, they're e-bagging. Oh, I knew it was going to come eventually. E-bagger. Before anybody starts that nonsense, <laughs> okay, which they're going to do anyway. There's going to be people who are going to do that just because that's how they're built. <laughs> you know, it's just how they're built. Forget the fact that they love coming and watching, you know, pretty young girls shooting guns. Forget that, you know. Uh, forget the fact that it costs money to make a video because, you know, every time you squeeze off a round, there's money involved. You know, ammo ain't exactly free. Wear and tear on guns, blah, blah, could go in it forever. But anyway, here's my, here's my proposal for those of you who are still with us. I know that some of you who've seen the, uh, the Christmas card love that photo. And even Cutlery Lover said, Jeff said, he goes, you could, you could charge for that. It is a really great photo. Don't ask me how I pulled that off, but I did. Granted, working with somebody who's had modeling experience and is, uh, is all kinds of professional helped for sure. Um, here's the thing. I'm going to have a PayPal link down below. And... Now, I know this isn't, isn't much, but I'll tell you what, guys. I think this is pretty cool. I think it came up with a pretty good idea. I had Cambria sign a bunch of these photos uh, to 500. So this one here is actually 5 of 500. Five, let me see if I can get to that. 5 of 500. It will not be any more than 500 of these 8 by... This is actually an 8 by 12, I think. I had to do the 8 by 12 because the uh, 8 by 10 cut off the gun. So, um, and then she signed it. Cambria Lee. Um, XOXO. Can't really. XOXO. It's a very, very, very cool photograph. 
I'm gonna have a PayPal link for everybody who donates, and we're talking donations, a minimum of $15, now you can donate a buck if you want, okay? But if you donate a minimum of uh, $15, you will get one of these signed and numbered prints. Uh, eight by 12 prints of Cambria Lee laying on this bear rug uh, with, uh, most of you guys r uh, recognize my Thompson Omega. Um, it's, a, it's really an awesome photo, it just is. It's kind of sexy, so if you got wives or girlfriends, you might wanna make sure they don't see it. But uh, if you don't want this, but you still wanna donate, by all means, donate. If you, uh, if you can only give a buck, give a buck. So, yeah, I mean, you know, I think between all of us, we could probably get her where she needs to be as far as getting that gun goes, and maybe even get her some ammo to practice with. You know, um, I know it's Christmas time, guys. I know it's tough. Um, right now, it's just tough. It's tough all over. Um, but if you just give a couple of bucks, tis the season to give. She is a great person. She really is. She deserves to have a better life than slinging pizzas, for God's sake. And that's no, listen, Cambry, I know you're going to watch this. That's, that's nothing personal, hon. Um, but, you know, I, I want to see you become that firearms instructor that you really want to be. Um, no, nothing against the pizza. Listen, she goes to work every day. She works very hard, making not a, not enough, literally not enough. And I could tell you some stories about her living situation and stuff. Try to drag the tears out of you, but you know what? First, it would probably just embarrass her, and secondly, you know, it's it's not my place, I guess. So let's just put it that way. Um, but if you guys can help, please do. Share this video. Uh, kind of put the word out. Even if if you can't donate a buck. Share the video, you know, ask other people if they could maybe help. You know, $475 I know is a lot of money, but I think that when you consider she's got over 300,000 views on her YouTube, on her YouTube channel, just her personal YouTube channel, I mean, I think it's doable. I just do. I think 475 bucks is doable. If you got some um, 9 millimeter ammo that you want to donate to the cause, um, by all means. Now she's shooting a Glock, so you know it's tricky with reloads. But you know what? Trigger times trigger time. I've got a gun that she can she can shoot reloads in. Um, I mean, or, or you know, 40 cal, whatever. If you can send her anything to help her on her way. And by the way, um, and this is just a thought. I mean, if you're a big donor, maybe we could work something out where you know we get a jersey made, and she, you know you're part of the team, and you you know have your YouTube channel logo put on it or something. I mean, that's just thinking impromptu. But yeah, guys, I mean, listen, trust me, you'll love this photo. This one here's gonna be a, bit, a little bent if you get this one, but <laughs> you'll love the, you'll know that this was the one that was in the video. Um, you'll love this, you really will, you'll love this. It's a really great photograph. It is a great print, it's quality, it's not some cheap thing. Um, so, yeah, and by the way, and I'm thinking about this, uh, and and I don't, when I got those, uh, those uh, eight by 12s, um, they gave me uh, about, I think four or five of these 12 month or 12 month calendars for free. I may even, I may even do something where you get one of these two, um, or ads with or whatever. Um, so anyway, let me know what you guys think. Like I said, let's help this girl out. She's a great person. She's a great shooter. Um, you know, and by the way, real quick, before anybody says, well, why doesn't she just save the money? Let me tell you something. <sighs> She's a single mother, and before she spends $475 on a gun, trust me when I tell you guys that that money will be spent on her child. It's just the way it is, and, you know, I, I respect her for that. Um, you know, when you're a single mother uh, or a parent in general, those of you who are parents out there, you know, you know, your kid comes first in everything in life. So, anyway, that's all I got for you guys. There's no sense in making this video forever long. Everybody take care. See ya!